Anybody else? <clears throat> uh, Edwin Hewitt. Um, the matter of the audit is extremely important to our county. And I don't know if the three of you as our commission has queued up, if you paid attention to what a newly appointed Attorney General, former auditor Hector Balderas said to you. I don't know if you paid attention to what our newly elected auditor Tim Keller has said to you. And my interpretation of that is you need to take direct affinitive action now. And if you don't do this, this county is going to become Sunland Park all over again. And I don't know if you've discussed the ramifications of a complete DFA takeover, but I don't know if other people realize what that means, but that means your checkbook is gone. You won't get any more state money. You won't get any, anything from anywhere. And all of the power that you've been entrusted with from the public will be gone, and you will be micromanaged. Um, as an individual, I'm begging you to not let this happen to our county. Um, on a personal note, I'm ashamed, Mr. Candelaria and Mr. Frost, you represent the Republicans of this county, and yet you refuse to stand up for Republican values. You represent these people in this valley, whether you're Republican or not, and you refuse to represent the people. We trusted you, you were seated, and I'm asking you respectfully to either honor that trust or resign and let someone else take those seats that has the intelligence and the intent to serve the public. And as to the, the issue with the county manager, these aren't light issues, these are major issues. And in the private world of business, uh, the manager would have been fired. And you know, for you guys to act like you're better than private business is incorrect activity in my opinion. So I, I mimic uh, these other speakers sentiments, I would respectfully ask the two of you to resign and respectfully ask the county manager be dismissed. Thank you.